Hey guys, so last month I went to Hong Kong and I did a little bit of shopping so I got a mini haul for you guys. Um, I haven't been doing hauls video lately, I'm sorry because I didn't have the time. But I finally managed to find time today so let's do this. So recently I really got into makeup and stuff so I thought, you know, why not get some stuff for the face when I was in Hong Kong since makeup there is cheaper. So when I was at um, Yi Saint Laurent, I got two really nice shades of lipsticks. So they look like this. And I really like the design, they're like gold and I got a red shade and a pink shade. So this is number 4 and this is number 32 and they gave off two totally different looks because this is more of a hot look, you know, at night and stuff. This is more of a day look but you want to look normal, cute and yeah, we look refreshing. So these are the two shades that I got. And I also got this highlighter from them as well. So this is called the Tushy Clack. The Radiant Touch one. And what it does, it highlights your... It kind of like enhances the features in your face. So as you guys know, my nose is very obvious. It's very flat. So when I apply this on here, it kind of produced the bridge instantly on my face. So it's really, really cool. And you can also make a fuller lip. So if you were to line over here and here on your lips, it'll be like bigger, thicker, and it'll look nicer as well. So that's why I'm going to try this out. Here as lip balms has also been really popular. Unfortunately, um, Australia and Malaysia do not have them. So I found them in Hong Kong, which is a really good thing. And I decided to get six different flavors. So I got a pomegranate flavor and also a strawberry flavor and also a lemon flavor and also a honey supple flavor which is like a melon flavor I also got the blueberry flavored one and also the summer fruit is it summer fruit? yeah and I also got the summer fruit one so you know it depends on the mood and the time of the day as well depending on how what I feel like you know like the flavor I'll just apply that and apparently it's really nice in your lips it's very smooth and helps to keep your lips hydrated all the time which is really good um, I was also at MAC and um, a lot of people told me that MAC brushes are really good and since I was getting into makeup I thought yeah why not you know get their brushes but because I haven't really used brushes before I was thinking you know why not get the traveling kit so I got the stroke of midnight um, essentials and these are really handy I reckon because it's my first time using brushes and these are really really good like since it'll help me learn more and when I get better I can get like the actual big ones so the difference with this one and the real big ones is this is machine made and the big ones like man made so big ones are obviously big, like the original size are obviously better but since I'm like learning to do this I thought yeah this will be good so they come in five like different brushes and they have the foundation brush, they have the main color eyeshadow brush, they have the blush and shading brush, they have the blending brush, and also an eyeliner brush, the angle brush. I can't wait to try them out. And the girl was telling me, oh, it comes in this case as well, sorry. It's a very nice goldish, blackish white case, which is very classic and is really nice. And I also got the what do you call it, the brush cleaner for it because the lady recommended this because um, every time when you um, use your brushes you're supposed to clean them and it will be like you know not infected with like I don't know it will be very you know you, when you use brushes you're supposed to be clean and you're supposed to take care of them really well so they can last really long. She also told me that um, you know once in a while we can also use the soap for your hair like the shampoo and you can use them on the brushes as well and you just wash them away and it'll be all good. So yeah do that. I also got um, a mirror from Chanel because I really need a mirror and I I have this bad habit of doing my makeup in buses or in the car because I am not the type that likes to get up early for now which hopefully I need to change this yeah and I tend to rush to the bus and everything and then only I take my time doing my makeup in the car or in the bus so 
um, I realized I need a really good mirror for that because sometimes you know when you're drawing stuff or and if you don't have like a really good mirror you can't really see so this is the duo mirror that I got from Chanel it's very nice like very sharp and very clear uh, and I reckon that it's very useful um, to use and sorry and they come with a little pouch as well so you can put it in and you won't be afraid of scratching it which is really good and I was also at Marc Jacobs and Marc Jacobs is usually cheaper in Hong Kong as well so I got myself a new wallet which I need for uni which is very good because they have you know a lot of compartments and everything inside so I can just put a lot of stuff like I'm a person with a lot of cards so this would be a really good wallet to use and I also got um, a laptop bag because I will be getting a new MacBook when it comes out maybe I don't know the new, the new ones like the 2014 one well my old one is currently six years old so it's getting really slow and everything so I just can't wait to buy the new MacBook so this will be for the new MacBook um, yeah it's a really nice bag um, the pink shade is really nice I and there's a pocket behind here so you can just open it and I'm guessing this is where you put your charger and stuff because it's very deep and it's very handy. Um, the cushion inside the bag is really good as well. Yeah, it's it's good. Even if I drop my Mac accidentally, it will be protected because I'm a very clumsy person, which is not good. And I also got my pair of new heels slash boots sort of thing. I forgot what are these called, but these are one of the new things that people like to wear. Like, um, the wedges boots I think, I'm not sure actually but they're very very nice to walk in and they give you an uh, increase in height as well so when you walk in these you feel taller and you feel like you're wearing heels but you're not so these are very nice I got a black and gold one from Aldo and I also got this um, thing from one of the department stores when I was with my mom and sister when we were looking at all the bento boxes or the kitchen stuff I need a bento box and I haven't got one yet so I thought you know why not I get the small ones first so these are to put your sauces in like your soy sauce your sweet chili sauce when you eat and it looks really cute and you know how I went to Japan recently well in Hong Kong I was in Sogo with my mom and they happened to sell the brand that I bought in Japan which is called Liz Lisa and I got a white jacket from them and I thought yeah why not it's so cute so I got this and it's very handy I reckon with like little patterns at the bottom I can't wait for winter to come so I can test out all these coats and the last thing that well not me, but my sister got for me for my birthday from Hong Kong was this. So this is, you know, when you travel around on the airplane, you need something to sleep on. And this is from the brand Go. And it's very, very comfortable because this is a very cushioned pill. Look at that. And it just bounces back up and bounces back up. I forgot what's the name for it. There's a special name for this pillow. Um, let me know if you remember. It's the sleep dream, like a very spongy pillow. Oh, I forgot what's the name. So I'm so sorry, guys. But it looks like that. It's very comfortable and I really like using it. So yeah, that's all the stuff that I got from Hong Kong. I'll be doing a Malaysian haul soon. And see you guys.